Hello, Troop Tribe and Crew. Mrs. Koenig here with your common word study for today. Today I would like to explore the word part try. Try means three. It's pretty simple. Try means three. The word part itself is a prefix. You will see it at the beginning of a word. And the part of speech it belongs to is Greek and Latin because the Greek and Latin numbers for three are very similar to try and also in Spanish, you know, today means three as well. So it does originate from that part of the world. Some examples of words that contain the prefix tri would be a tricycle, which is in the bottom, bottom lower left corner. That is a three-wheeled cycle or a three-wheeled bike. A tripod, which is in the bottom right corner, is a stand used for balance to put something on top so that someone doesn't have to hold it. The three legs um, provide a good sturdy balance for whatever the object is on top. And it's called a tripod because it, it has three legs. Triple, is it means three times of something. So if I want tr a triple scoop of, some, of ice cream, I want three scoops. If um, the baseball player uh, got, was able to get a triple, it means that they hit the ball hard enough that they were able to run three bases before having to stop. And the last example is trident. Trident is, is in the upper left corner. There's a picture of a trident. A trident is a weapon that was used long ago in battle. It is basically a spear, and at the end of the spear, has it has three separate arrows. And of course, the reasoning behind that would be to inflict more pain and injury on whoever was, you know, being attacked, because you have one spear in your hand, but you you actually have three different puncture wounds. So most often, it was not a very pleasant um, thing to receive if you were stabbed. And also, um, if those of you that read the book Hunger Games, I know when you head into uh, Catching Fire, you know that uh, Phoenix's weapon of choice is the trident. So um, maybe you, you heard that word and you weren't really sure of what that was. Well, now you have a picture of it so you get a better idea of why Phoenix wanted that particular weapon. So there you have it. Um, not lots of fancy stuff today for try, but just a real cut and dry, simple common word study for you. And I hope you learned something about the prefix try. Have a great day, readers and writers.